We're out in the world. Dad had me stop here at a Dollar General store. Because uh, he needs to buy some stuff for the Legion like trash bags and I don't know what else. Cleaning solvent. Uh, I don't know. My cousin Roy gave him $40 in a list and said, here, buy this. And then after this, we're going to actually go up to St. Joe, Michigan before we go get the other supplies. Because they had their ice sculpture festival this last weekend. And we're going to go see if we can find any ice sculptures. I hope so. Um, this is the town that has the little, like, the little uh, snowman outside. So, yeah. Uh, I'm excited to see what kind of ice sculptures they had. Um, so, yeah. And we still got soup to deliver in the back. But now I'm just sitting here waiting. Because there's nothing I want in there. And I have no money at all on me. Hmm. I had money, but I left it at home. Oh well. Uh, I'll see y'all later. Bye. Hey everybody, remember when I brought you to Lake Michigan and it was ice as far as the eye can see? We're back at the same area. And, um... You can see the lake now. Water. You can see some ice and then water. As far as the eye can see. Uh, uh, right across to Chicago. Yeah, over that way, Chicago. Yeah, we just went... Ooh, oh, I almost dropped you. <laughs> we went and took pictures of some ice sculptures around St. Joe, which I'll probably insert uh, after this little clip. And so now we're off to get, uh, where are we off to? Gordon's. Just off to Gordon's to get stuff for the Legion. Yep, like a case of French fries and stuff like that. So I just wanted to show you the lake. Bye! What do you say? Bye! Where are we at now? We are at oh, Aldi! That's so sunny you can't see. Dad wanted to buy some, oh there he is going in. He wanted to get some more peaches and he wanted to look for some cleaning stuff that he could not find at the other store. So yeah, he said stop there. And uh, then he got us all jacked around. I listened to him and I shouldn't have. I should have gone the way I knew. And he goes, go straight up here. So I'm going and I'm like, where are we going? Oh, you should have turned back there. I was gonna turn back there, but you told me to go straight. So then I didn't. I didn't listen to him after that. I said I'm gonna go down here, hit the bypass, jog around, and get back over here. He goes, well, maybe if we just turn around. I'm like, there's nowhere to turn around. We're on a highway with nothing to turn around on. So we got back here, and then we're gonna go to Gordon's Food Service, where he's gonna buy the, you know, fries and crap, and uh, then we'll be heading to. Drop it all off at the Legion. He said they spent he spent about three or four hours there this morning when they were cleaning. So he was tired. He took a little nap when he got home. It's sunny and pretty. Still cold though. A lot of the ice sculptures that we saw, the ones that were in the sun, were kind of pathetic. There were a lot of them we didn't take pictures of because they were just crumbled to bits. The ones that were in the shade were holding up pretty well. Yeah. But okay, I'm gonna go now. 
I don't think I hit the button. While I was sitting here, I thought, I'll try to call Eurus. So I called the cell phone, and he answered. Usually he doesn't answer because usually he doesn't have any minutes on his phone. But he answered, and he can only talk for a brief minute. But he's in California. He's in Santa Barbara right now. And um, he's out there for a while. He doesn't know when he'll be coming back, but he is coming back someday. Yeah. But uh, he ended up sleeping in the rain last night, and all his stuff's wet. And he has a shopping cart, which he's pushing. Right now he's hoboing it, people. So if you see a scruff, scruffy portly man in Santa Barbara pushing a shopping cart, it could be yours. But he sat it in good spirits and um, he's used to roughing it. So uh, I just, he's safe and he's okay. And uh, it was nice to know because he's been gone for a long time. Uh, let's see, I think he left back in October? Over December, January. Yeah, he's been gone for a while. So. Who knows what, what where he'll end up next. But I thought I'd give you an update on my odd little friend, Eurus. I was excited that he answered because now I know he's okay because I've tried to call him like four or five times and it goes right to his voicemail. So I was ecstatic to see, hear him go, hello. <laughs> so, okay, that's all. I'm still waiting on all these for dad to come out. Bye.